CN100 presents the high school game of the week. This week's matchup, the St. Joseph Chargers take on the Wheaton North Falcons, all part of the 20th annual Batavia Night of Hoops. Welcome to Batavia High School, Batavia, Illinois, everyone, as we get ready for all sorts of exciting high school basketball action for you on CN100. I'm Perry Williams, joined by the coach, John Cohn, and great to have you with us. And coach, what an interesting matchup we have here tonight between the Chargers and the Falcons. Yeah, it's one of the fun things about these showcase games. You get matchups you might not normally see. Wheaton North out of the DuPage Valley taking on St. Joe's from the Catholic League. Two schools that might not normally play each other, and you always love the atmosphere here at the Batavia Night of Hoops. Let's talk about the team, starting with St. Joseph, one of the legendary programs in the state. Of course, the Hall of Fame coach, Gene uh, Pingator, and each and every year they have an outstanding club, and this team is, seems to be putting it together. Winning record, 13-10. and 10. They were highly ranked Perry at the start of the year struggled a little bit they've had trouble getting everybody healthy and eligible at the same time they're starting to get there playing their best basketball now a very talented team that hasn't yet played their best basketball and for Wheat North they've had such great success on the football field and the uh, the basketball team at least they're at 500 and they'll be missing a couple of their key players tonight but they can surprise too yeah that's gonna hurt missing a couple of key guys but a good ball club 11 and 11 Dave Frackman in his first year as the head coach moving up from the sophomore team Good, solid ball club. Guys are going to have to step up tonight, Perry, because they are missing two of their leading scorers. He's been their most impressive player so far. Vosberg, 6'3", 175-pound senior. Draining the shots. Got a couple of nice passes already. Good, solid ball player, Mitch Vosberg. Inside a minute remaining in the first quarter. Nice spin move and smooth move in the lane by Patty. He now has five in the ball game. That's a big-time move by A.J. Patty, no question about it. We saw the outside shot, Perry, that time. The nice post move inside. Motion offense for Wheaton North. Tough shot and it goes for Howes. I don't know how he got that off. If he score points for degree of difficulty, give him about six points for that one. Only counts as two, but uh, high degree of difficulty there by Jalen Howes. Great shot. And now on the rebound is Turner. Turner brings it up the floor for the Chargers into the corner to Watson. Watson. And that is vintage A.J. Patty. If he could play like this every night, if A.J. Patty can bring this type of game every night, going to make St. Joe's awfully dangerous come tournament time a couple of weeks down the road. He got the long snapper and he played. got the long passer uh, off the inbound. Pelts played that basketball as freshman. And look at that move by Slavinsky. Two more for the junior. Going to look at Andrew Slavinsky having a big game here on a TV CN100 game right over A.J. Patty. Off the inbound, well, with uh, 21 seconds, it's stolen away by Slavinsky. Oh. And back the other way. Track down, and the jam by Hash. And what a play by Watson with the steal and over the hit shoulder pass. That was the play of the game because with the steal, Wheaton North was only down three, one possession game, but it was the quick hands of Glenn Watson, one sophomore, and he makes the little wraparound pass to Jordan Ash, the other sophomore, the two sophs coming up with the biggest play of the game. To view this exclusive Xfinity TV programming in its entirety, check the CN100 schedule for a list of airtimes or view this program anytime on demand by selecting Get Local and choosing CN100.